What's up, folks? Welcome to the 32nd episode of Tales from the Archive on Handle Arbor Games. My name is Zach from Another Letdown Media and the Adjacent Hex Podcast. I will be your host this evening. Tales from the Archive is the show where we use the medium of Sentinels of the Multiverse, the digital game, to tell a story of some kind. Some will be tales from the actual Sentinel storylines, and others, most of them, will be totally original and or based on previous work. For consistency's sake, I do try to match each story up with an existing Sentinel Comics book title that has been mentioned previously by either Christopher or Adam or both, but by no means does that make them real or official canon or anything like that. You can kind of think of this as the Earth-603 Sentinels of the Multiverse. There will often be times where I deliberately make a play that may not make a whole lot of sense strategically, but because it contributes in some way to the narrative we've created. I will do my best to win games, but even heroes fall sometimes and that just makes for great stories. As with all the shows on the Handle Arbor Games channel, we believe in civil rights for absolutely everyone, and in being as inclusive as possible, so any comments actively working against that goal are not welcome and will not be tolerated. So, without any more delay, let's open the oldie book of the multiverse and get this party started. And fair warning folks, it's an odd one. Tonight's story is of course called How the Guys Saved Giftmas. Um, I'm going to announce it here at the beginning of the show. I am taking the next couple of weeks off. I'm going, uh, we, my wife and I are going to visit her family for the holidays, so um, this will be the last one until after the new year. Uh, but that said, it's also been a very bizarre week here at Stream Northeast. Usually we spend the first few days of the week pulling issues of Sentinel Comics out of the vault and trying to find a good story to play. But this week, suddenly all of my agents were out on assignment. And legitimately, too. I checked all their all their logs in their computers literally no one was around the office working on their weekly tasks and i definitely saw all of them arrive in monday morning of course this made me curious so i started looking into the archive myself it wasn't until new comics day on wednesday that i realized that this month's issue current issue of the newly rebooted series of the best book guys gets his hands on santa's naughty nice list and infiltrates the real world to drag stream agents in to help him Turns out, uh, Wager Master convinced Santa to put all the heroes onto the naughty list, and Guys took it upon himself to both build, that's what he needed the stream operatives for, and deliver as many gifts as he possibly could in the span of two hours. He may or may not have overslept and got a very, very late start, so that the heroes would have a merry gift miss. Being that I was the only one in the office this week, I didn't really have enough time to fully analyze the book, so I suppose let's just take a look at how the rest of the issue played out. This could be interesting, folks. Uh, yes, so here we go. The first first uh, battle tonight takes us to the final wasteland where Guys finds most of the Freedom Five, although not Bunker suspiciously, fighting Akash Buddha. And of course he had to jump in and see what he could do to make things better, worse, and deliver as many gifts as possible. Here we go. Yes, Bunker is definitely bunking his duties. <laughs> Thank you, Darren. Uh, so guy, Santa Guys is starting out... Oh, so the stipulation tonight is Santa Guys must deliver as many gifts as he possibly can. And uh, the way I'm thinking of doing that is just running out as many cards as we possibly can, and then when situation gets dire, he dumps as many gifts as he possibly can all at once. So, uh, definitely more guysy. Uh, guys, Santa Guys is starting out with the best card ever, Abrasive Say Cheese, and, uh, yeah, I'm that guy. Legacy is starting out with Bolster Allies, Danger Sense, Lead from the Front, and Motivational Charge. Wraith is starting out with Impromptu Invention, Mega Computer, Micro Targeting Computer, and Suit Yourself. Absolute Zero has Cold Snap, Glacial Structure, Isothermic Transducer, and Onboard Module... I can never remember this card. Installation. It's my favorite card in the deck, and I can never remember what it's called. Uh, and Tachyon starting out with Lightspeed Barrage, Quick Insight, Research, Research Grant, and Sonic Vortex. And before you open an Inventory Barrage and fastbound, Frostbound Drain to kill Absolute Zero. Eh, you know, probably. Um, and as we all know, Akash Buddha does nasty things with limbs. Um, and uh, that, that's what happens. Snaring Brambles, sure. Yep, that'll happen. 
Santa guys can't deal damage. Okay, well, he's not planning on dealing a whole lot of damage anyway. Um, so he can do other things. He just has to put out his... Mini he has to use his gift power every single turn. Um, which, I mean, it's guys. He pretty much does that anyway. But... Uh, he can't deal damage, and he hasn't taken any hit points away. Uh, and that also does damage. Uh, Seamus Butler, if you would like to count how many gifts get opened, that would be awesome. Um, I'm not going to keep track of that. Um, but yeah, if you want to keep a storm count, um, go for it. The easiest way to identify that, I'm going to type that in the chat. Just do that whenever, whenever we, whenever we open uh, gifts. So, yeah, um, I think double or er, there's really not a whole. So he doesn't have any cards. That he, I mean, best card ever is fine because it does draw two cards. Yeah, I guess that's fine. We'll do best card ever. And so we draw another best card ever. Okay, we'll definitely chain that off. Woo! Woo! Um, actually, total beefcake is way better. Is way good here. Um, uh, okay, so we're gonna go ahead and... It does not do the addition for you. I apologize for that. I, I'm working on that because I love the idea of a storm count. Um, so you're just gonna kind of if, if you want if you're interested in doing it just post it in the chat that way that way people can, watching later can uh, can see and we'll put gifts out gifts for everybody and one for me of course super ultra yep and thank you for that too that's, that's fantastic uh, bolster allies All right, Wraith's for Ordinance, that's very nice. And we've got the Impromptu Invention in hand. Oh my gosh, Wraith is ready to go nuts. All right, Galvanize is ready. So here we go, Impromptu Invention time. And we'll go get the Micro-Targeting. Wait, do we have... Oh, I do. So, oh man. I guess having the backup is fine. Utility Belt is, is awesome here too. Yeah. And before rejuvenating entropy. Here's Marvel as Darren calls all the shots for the day. Oh, no, no, Epic Vulcan made one too. Sorry. All right. Let's do six. Put it to three. Ah, perfect. Nut draws. All right. Uh, so this is great. Um, we already had the isothermic transducer. Yep, so we're just going to go get the other one. We'll get the null point. We'll play isothermic. So that we can go this way. Gotta be careful with the galvanize up. But that should go exactsies for the ensnaring brambles. There we go. Start this party right now. Alrighty. Um, no sense. I mean, that's great. Draw three, discard three. Especially with guys giving gifts, there's... We gotta make sure we're getting things into the bin efficiently. Um, so I feel like just starting with quick insight is pretty good. Alright, let's discard a couple. Um, one and two. And yes, I'm aware those are good cards, but I want to get Tachyon set up as quickly as possible. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll bend that. And we will draw a Sucker Punch. Sweet. All right, environment. What do you got for us? Oh, wow. Okay. New Jersey Devil. That's frustrating, but... Oh, okay. Perfect. Thank you, Akash Buddha. Uh, Entomb and Rat Beast. Oh my goodness. Okay. Yep. So... Yeah, I mean, everybody can take that. 
and we'll destroy that. Oh, right. <laughs> well, it doesn't get destroyed because Guys is being selfish. Ow! Hey! Alright, so he has taken damage now and he can do deal damage. So playing another best card ever is not nothing. Um... Yep. Oh, it, it absolutely is. Um, attacking the phalanges is, is not the worst idea. I'd really love to be able to get rid of some stuff. She doesn't have a grappling hook, does she? Not yet. Um, because these are annoying. Especially with this environment, allies of the earth is frustrating. But uh, I think just. Best card ever, and see what we get. Okay. Uh, let's swing here. Woo! Definitely play more cards, especially with what we've got. Drawing cards is great. Um, actually, bring back best card ever might not be the worst. Alternately, say cheese is an option. Um, it's not going to bring it quite far down enough to, to get the full value out of it. You know what, let's see what we draw. Okay, blatant reference. And uh, yeah, I'm that guy. Man. Uh, blatant reference. That's fun, but I feel like I'd rather just get the uh, best card ever back. again. Everybody have another card. Yep, we got that. Um, Danger Sense is actually a consideration here. Surge of Strength is also an option, especially if we plan on motivational charging later. Let's go Danger Sense for now, because the environment can can be problematic. Um, combat Stance is, is not nothing. The Utility Belt is great, allowing me to prevent a little bit. Yeah, we'll do that. Prompt to a mention. Very nice. Wraith is just drawing all her gear. Like this is this is great for her. Um, null point is is cool. I don't want me to do this next turn, perhaps. And cold snap is great too. What I really want is the. Um, The, the gauntlet. Go ahead and take the damage here. And wipe out this. Nice. Okay. Oh, nice. That's what we needed to see. Um, also, blinding speed is great. That'll get rid of the Entomb or the allies. Um, yeah, while we've got a lull in the... I'm actually going to Fleet of Foot to start. Ah, excellent. The Legacy Ring. That, we needed to see that. We definitely... Okay, sweet. Hypersonic is great, too. Um, so let's Blinding Speed down the Entomb. Yep. That's what I was thinking. Allies of the Earth is... is it's not actively hurting us. So I feel like just... Okay, that's cool. Um, man, that's a good card to have around. Especially with... You know what? 
I am going to throw it away because I have the hypersonic assault kicking around right now. And with guys being weird. Yep, she's going to gain a little bit of hit points back. That's all right. Um, it'll take mountainous. Yep, that's fine. Aha! See? That was good. That was fun. Uh, so it's going to be five. I could just kill the devil outright. Or just run it back. I think I'm just going to hit the pit carabus here. Okay, that's, you know, that's not fun. But... Okay, cool. More targets, bring it on. Yep, yep. Unfortunately, Legacy can't deal damage. That's real frustrating. Alright, what did the... Uh, absolute zero can. Oh, that's not fun. Alright, um... Well, well, we'll play around it. Uh, best card ever. Certainly an option here. Say cheese. I could actually chain say cheeses and kill the carapace. Yeah, double, double will be useful. Go ahead and do this. Aha! Retcon, very nice. There we go. It's fine. Woo! Um, so retcon is an option to get rid of Allies of the Earth. It's, it's so insignificant. Whereas... I mean, I have nothing to redirect. Absolute Zero's shenanigans. Um, let me see that. I mean, I, if, I wonder if I can let me see that into... I can do that too. But let me try... Oh, wait a minute. No, oh, may have been a mistake. Yeah, that was a mistake. Did not mean to play that card. Um, I think I'm just going to retcon out the allies. Oh, shoot. Sorry, folks. Marvel as I make mistakes. Per usual. Alright. Let's retcon the allies of the Earth. Nope, that's the wrong one. There it is. And, uh, let's just draw cards. Actually, I guess I could have played Say Cheese there. Um, we're not quite in a dire enough situation where we need to start gifting. Oh, I gotta keep an eye on Legacy and Absolute Zero, and even Tachyon a little bit, but not super. Not too bad yet. Alright, um, so the Legacy Ring would be fun here, especially with Motivational Charge. I can search of strength as well. Uh, go ahead and do this. Galvanize. Ah, nice. Back to strike. It's gonna be a little while before we play it, but that's fine. Um, do I just? I guess I just start getting equipment, getting extra equipment out, and go for that inventory barrage. Prop to Invention is a sick card anyway. Um, let's see. Smoke Bombs is awesome. Let's just put that into play. And then we'll go ahead and play... Trust Fund gets us extra cards, so we'll go ahead and play that. Okay, sweet. Uh, those are not limited, so uh, let's get rid of the targeting computer and the utility belt because I've already got both of them out. And then let's start picking things off, I guess. Yep, 
sweet. Okay, throat jab is nice. Uh, he can't deal damage, so it's time for him to heal if he can. I don't know if he can. Actually, cold snap is really good. So let's go ahead and do that. Um, I don't think this works, but since we played a card... Yep. Oh, okay. So... That's odd. I wonder why it let me do the damage. Okay. Uh, Hypersonic Assault is great. <laughs> Not letting things deal damage seems good. I probably could have wiped out the Ensnaring Brambles here, but... Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll pin that. Oh, Sucker Punch should get rid of something, too. Ooh, nice, pushing the limits. I used to think that was a bad card. Hmm. That's really interesting. I don't know that that's a good thing. Oh, okay, well, that, that happens. Oh, man. Ugh, okay, well... I guess that happens. So much for Legacy's plan. <laughs> yep, you can't do damage. But that can. <laughs> yeah. Unfortunately, that comes to... Alright, um... Alright, everybody's okay. We're not great. Eh, guys is fine. I guess we can say cheese and just say cheese. Or can we? Uh, it's still just like two. There's no ongoings in play right now, so that's not useful. Um, I guess I could... Alright, I'm going to try something. Oh, that's true, I could do that. I didn't even think of that. Yeah, you're right. Say cheese to heal up absolute zero. Wait. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Do this. There you go. I didn't even think of that. It's cold damage. Um, yep, not quite time to start gifting yet. This is probably where we're going to start turning things over. But we'll see what healths are at. Alright, so Legacy's plan kind of got nerfed. Um, good thing we didn't play the Legacy. Well, oh, oh, oh that's just a... Surge of Strength is awesome. Yeah, Surge of Strength. Okay. Alright, another back fist strike. Sweet. Alright, um... Run out the mega computers. Sure. I need to see what Tachyon's holding. It's just one target. That could do it. Yeah. Okay, so Sonic Vortex. So the more things we can get to the bottom, the better off we're going to be. So... 
That puts it to two. That'll do. For that. And then we'll... Uh, yeah. That. Yep. Sweet. All right. Um... himself up a little bit with the frostbound drain that's four health recovery and then four to himself redirected to five somewhere else uh, so that's not that's definitely a consideration um, that's not what we're looking for to do right now field freezes yeah each non-hero target So, yeah, I guess it's Frostbound Drain. Oh, he, ah, whoops. Okay, never mind. I didn't see what the Ensnaring Brambles hit. I was moving a little too fast. So, I guess... I don't understand the point of that card. I mean, I do. But it just seems very situational. We're in a glacial structure. Just so we have a different power to use. So we can draw some cards. Four fires, nice. Modular realignment. And a null point. Alright. That's well, not exactly what we were looking for, but it'll do. Alright, Tachyon. Unfortunately, she's only got two targets for Sonic Vortex. Uh, unless, well, actually, pushing the limits is an option. Um, we can Nimble Strike to deal two. It's not fantastic. Um, Sucker Punch doesn't help. Well, maybe it does. Let's push the limits and see where that takes us. We'll, su we'll Sonic Vortex, I think literally everything. One, two, three, four, five, six, yep. So we'll just everything, everything, everything. Oh, sweet. No, we're definitely not discarding that. Because that is handy dandy. It's for villain decks like a cop. Yeah, exactly. Okay. The Abominable Snowman. Now, there's no ensnaring brambles yet, although <laughs> the primeval eruption happens. Yep, there's another ensnaring bramble, so someone's not going to be able to do damage. Mountainous Carapace. Yeah, I, I know. I know that. But in flavor, Tachyon's probably moving a little bit too fast to realize what she's doing. Uh, oh, Wraith's got the stealth up, so... That'll come there. Everybody takes three. Okay. Everybody still takes three. Oh, okay, it's definitely time to start, uh, I think it's time to start gifting things. Because we're all, well, with the exception of Legacy, we're all in kind of dire straits here, and we're not in a way to, um, who's, who's not dealing damage? Tachyon. Okay. Um... And we can heal up absolute zero. I can deal it to one of these guys. Um, oh, wait. Whoops. Oh, well. Heal up absolute zero. Derp.
All right. Storm time, Seamus Butler. Um, we're going to have... I have absolute zero turn to step over. Nice. It's four damage. Oh, I need to add four. No, I don't. Okay. It's fine. Thank you. Awesome. Okay. Get rid of this. Or. Hold on. Yep. I guess we can start getting rid of something bigger. Let's come with this. And then he'll do a uh, target three. What does this one say? Non environment target with the second lowest. Well, we'll see what happens. Um, we'll do this. Yep, he'll heal up. He'll deal himself damage again. We'll hit this. question is, do we just start back fist striking, or do I legacy ring and prevent him from taking some damage? I guess getting set up seems better. We can always, we can always back fist strike later. Ah, there's motivational charge back. That's helpful. Um... Not allowing something to deal damage. Ratio for Dan. I I had an entry and I never sent it. Um, it was kind of kind of a weird situation. Um, Living Rock Slide is dealing way more damage than anything else right now. So that seems like a good target. Um. Start coming at the carapaces, car carapaces, car carapai. Although that said, I do now have uh, questions. After after post episode, I have lots of questions. Uh, it's currently tapping, so okay, absolute zero is free to go ham. Um, and we have the focused apertures now, which is awesome. So let's do it. Um, if he, well, he's above 10, and it's going to be, what, 4? Puts him to 9. He's not dead, so let's do it. Let's do... Oh, it's 5. Sick. Oh, sweet. That gets rid of the carapace right away. Yeah, I, I, I have to power hound as well. I mean, so... I mean, without giving away my questions, because that seems bad. Um, there was... How do I say this? There was a thing that happened... <laughs> with regard to con Cosmic Contest. Um... Yeah, I, I, there's no way to say this without giving away my uh, my entire question. So, do I just do this to him? Or do I take something out? Because a gain of nine is quite a lot. 
of course, doubles his hit, literally doubles his hit points. No, we can take out the Bramble. Oh, yeah. Just take, taking Brambles right out. Seems pretty, pretty fun. I did as well. I, I, I can tell you that. Uh, yeah, she can't deal damage. <laughs> Thank you, Ensnaring Brambles! We like... Okay, that was weird. Uh, Hypersonic Assault can't trigger this turn, but can next turn, so that's nice. Um, none of these... Oh, she... Ah, nuts. Oh, okay, I guess that didn't matter anyway. Hmm. Okay, we'll just play out Research Grant. And do this. Ooh, sweet. Alright. Um, we would discard... I would discard... Yep, Nimble Strike. Sucker Punch is great. You can't have to have around. Okay. People are not doing super well. Chupacabra. That's gonna come at... That doesn't matter. I guess I'd rather have this out of the way. Yep. <laughs> okay. Man, Earth Sacrifice is annoying. Yep. That sure happens. Okay. So guys still needs to be given gifts here. Uh, people are not super duper healthy, and Akash Buddha is just a little bit over half. Um, let's see, what has he got? Yeah, I'm that guy. Doesn't that... That is... I, I, I'm wondering if that's tripped up a lot more people than... Uh, than just you ratio for Dan. Like, the the version of the character definitely, uh, definitely t tells a lot of the story. Um, okay, I'm gonna double gimmicky character. <laughs> One. Okay. Do double. We'll do it again. Nothing. Wow. Two decks full of targets. Or is it, what is it? Non? -care? Yeah, target. Two decks full of targets, and I completely whiff. That seems perfect. All right. We're going to galvanize with, with guys here. And you didn't say it. Boom. All right. Um... Tachyon can deal damage, so yeah, let's do let's do Tachyon. What do we want a legacy here? Legacy up next. That's a tough call. Let's go Tachyon. Okay. Um, that one's a little riskier, I guess. Play up to two cards. Okay. Um, how about this one? Ah, but she's also playing two cards, Seamus Butler, so that's it actually brings the storm to ten. This is part of the gift. And second card. We do have something at two. So we could Sucker Punch. Alternatively, um, nope, I think that's good. Sucker Punch it. Thank you. Ah, excellent. Look at this. Now we're going to him. Yeah, for sure. 
I wish it said guys is galvanized, because it was really ga ga guys that galvanized there. Guys the Barbarian. Now we're moving things forward. Um, so motivational charge is the play here, so that we can galvanize. And then motivational charge, heal everybody up a little bit. And we can take care of the rock slide, because that's doing a lot more damage. Yes. Alrighty. Um, is it time to inventory barrage yet? Probably not. That's So it's 10 damage. Getting a little bit more going seems a little bit better to me. Um, yeah, Absolute Zero, like, now that I've been playing more with Absolute Zero, I'm like, oh my gosh, she's so good. And the Sentinels are the same thing, like, they're, they're just fun, fun, fun characters. Um, so let's do, okay. Looking here, there is one inventory barrage. I don't know if there's three in the deck. Let's go ahead and just get more stuff kicking around. Uh, also, the this would not be the worst <laughs> to start rigging her deck. Um, yeah, playing the Sentinels against Akash Buddha seems not wise. All right, let's take a look at her deck. Um, I, <laughs> no, get that out of here. Primeval eruption. I'd, I'd rather have that on the top. <laughs> okay, there's the other inventory barrage, so sweet. She's going to get gifted next, I think. All right, a zero. What are you doing? Ooh, he's got Horrorfire back. Sweet! Do that again. That seemed like fun. That was fun. <laughs> yeah, let's do it. Horrorfire. Alright, two cold damage. Coming at Arboreal Phalanges. What's the Chupacabra hitting? Are they? I, I've never even tried. I'll be honest. Uh, let's let's hit himself with this, just because he is a valid target, and a gain of five is pretty good. Um, let's wipe out the rock slide here and hit her. And then we'll hit himself for four and three. And we'll kill this. Get a bunch of stuff out of the way. Um, okay. Do we heal up? or No, we're just going nuts here. Uh, I gotta hit the Chupacabra, don't I? So the Chupacabra hits us if, if I don't. Unless, I've got, unless Tachyon has something that... No, she doesn't. So, because she's light speed barraging here. Or, how much? What's the light speed barrage at? So it's twelve. So twenty-four. Uh, it's not enough to kill us. So oh yeah, that's true. That's true. Um. I was dealing four to one thing, though. Possibly five. And it's going to be to Legacy. Alright, we're going to come into Kosh Buddha. Let's live dangerously. This could come back to bite us, but let's see. Please tell me I have hot goggles. I don't. Oh, I do. It's in play, too. Sweet. Alright, uh, so that's double light speed barrage. Let's do it. For a total of 28. Yep, 
Yep. Um. Yeah, we can bin that just based on the fact that we're going to hypersonic assault next turn, whatever she plays. Okay, synaptic interruption. That's sweet. <laughs> nice. Okay, rat beast. Yep. Okay, we knew that was coming. And okay, yep, yep, yep. Okay, yep. Oh, okay. That's unpleasant, but not strictly the worst. It's not good either. Okay, we gotta get through. All right, what are what are these preventing? They should be. Is it the same one? Come on. Legacy can't deal damage. Legacy can't deal damage. Okay. Sweet. So. He's kind of on support anyway. And his power. One of his powers just kind of allows him to heal things. So that's great. Uh, Guys the Barbarian. Uh, who are we going to reveal this turn? It's Wraith. So. Um, let's see. The more damage we can do, the better. And there is a Mountainous Carapace in play. Here's what we're gonna do. I can do that too. We're gonna galvanize. Actually, I mean, oh, that's true. Guys, the barbarian in open presence. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, all right. I didn't even think of that, you're right. <laughs> and he makes noises. You know, I'm just gonna take a minute to open my own presence. Because it's guys miss. I mean, gift miss. Oh dear. Okay. Um. Legacy ring? Already beyond the play phase. Hmm. Yeah, Storm is definitely 14. Um, just in case, because if we flip over, I have an idea. Total beefcake. Selling out. Uh-oh. Are we going to whiff? Yeah, we totally whiffed. <laughs> Oops. All right, well, it happens. Next evolution is an option. Danger sense is an option. Could just backfist. Sure, why not? Oh, right, he can't deal damage. Duh. Yeah, it's danger sense. Oh yeah, because these are bad anyway. Uh, so I mean, it doesn't matter, but healing up seems pretty strong. Another danger sense, can't hurt. Um, the question is, do we... No, you know what? I was going to say, do we inventory barrage here? Or do we... Just put out more equipment uh, because of the chance... I, gotta, I can't remember if there's three inventory barrages in the deck or not. Um, but if there is, and, and one of these four is... Inventory brought. Even if it's not, just having extra equipment out seems great. So let's steal something that's a bunch of damage. Can we come straight at her? It's five. Better to do six, I guess. Yeah, sure. And then... Rigging deck. What do we got? Oh, man. Oh, it's the same ones? Wait, is she just out of cards? No, okay. Man. Man, that's annoying. 
really don't want to destroy equipment cards. Not that we couldn't take them from somewhere else, but... Oh, sweet. That's a little too late. Too, a little too late. And Tomb is really going to be a problem. Um, destroy... Ah, perfect. And what's Thermal Shockwave? I'm going to field freeze just to get rid of Entomb. I know it's not the most exciting play ever, but I don't want that dealing. Oh, right. Guys is a bunch of stuff. Sorry, guys. I'm getting rid of let me see that. You whiffed. You were useless. Oh, right. Okay, selling out is good. Yep, that's exactly what I was thinking. Field freeze, and get rid of guys cards. Uh, yeah, get rid of Tony Beefcake. All right, uh, that's just everything deals. Yep. Okay, sweet. Let's start here. We may be able to pull this off, folks. Just choose for me at that point, but there you are. Uh, he go, she goes to six, um, which we can deal with. Definitely deal fire damage. Oh wait a minute, wouldn't it have made? Uh, no. Yep, perfect. So ensnare, and that'll deal death. Got there. Oh well, look at that. I've already delivered 14 gifts, and it's only... Uh-oh. I better hurry things up. Alright, game two. Guys is headed to... Oh, this one's going to be an interesting one. Uh, this... He is headed to Pike Industrial Complex. Where he finds... Where are they? Wow. Okay, I can see, I promise. Uh, where he finds the Dark Watch. Come on, get in there. Facing off against, of all per of all people, Cargo Warfang. I don't know how we're gonna pull this one off. because of how Karga's deck plays. Oh, shoot, I forgot to put guys in. Uh, whoops, okay, gotta restart that one. My bad. I forgot to put guys in. Let's not do that again. Um, Thing. Environment, like industrial. And now we're ready. Whoops! Now. Alright, Santa Guys has best card ever, blatant reference, gr gritty reboot gritty reboot and retcon. Expatriate hat or Dark Watch Expatriate has hollow points, quick draw, reload, and RPG launcher. Dark Watch Mr. Fixer has alternating Tiger Claw, Bloody Knuckles, Hoist Chain, and Riven Crane. Uh, Dark Watch Night Mist has Mist Fueled Recovery, Mists of Time, Oblivion, Planar Banishment. And Dark Watch Setback has Cash Out, High Risk Behavior, Comic Retribution, and Silver Lining. Um, let's do this. Okay, so we got a Gladiator. No 
Okay, Cargra's in. Cargra's already in. Look at that. That's kind of how it's going to work. And I and she's already up to three, so this this could be really fast. Guys could just fail miserably. On this one. Alright. Um Oh man. <laughs> Best card ever seems like a good place to start. Just yet. Say cheese. Not strictly value. However, where did I put that? Seems like pretty. Seems pretty good to me. That'll work. And let's get some gifts out there. seems like a pretty good option. RPG launcher doesn't do anything yet, so yeah, let's quick draw. Uh, let's get that one. Let's fire it at something. Alright, fixer. Once in a while, so I have a volume control on my waist, and uh, every once in a while it hits the side of my chair. It startles me. Uh, ribbon crane is not the worst, especially against a passive. based on where everybody is right now. Yeah, let's let's go ahead and oblivion. Let's start by start by going nuts. They have the same. Oh lovely. Yeah, we caught right up. As a title. Build the top three cards of your deck, put them back in any order. Alright, what do we got? Tome of Elder Magic. Not the worst. Mistbound. Discard two if you do. Select a deck. Mistbound's pretty good. Let's let's do that. Okay, sweet. Um alright. So currently he has nothing. He doesn't have anything in there, you know. So he can't do anything about removing tokens, but... I'm going to go ahead and do high-risk behavior. And try and get some of the other stuff banging around, powered up. Unfortunately, he can't use his power, so I'll do that. Looking up, sweet. That's a good draw. Yeah, no, it's... I am kind of... Captain Understatement. So really that should have sound, sounded more like, that car, that car's pretty good. Oh, no. Thank you, Cargo. Appreciate that. Alright. She's up to six. Oh my gosh. 
all the damage coming at us. She's up to 10 already. I may have, like, one turn and then I have to start giving gifts, so. Um, there's nothing to destroy with Retcon. Extreme. Let's, okay. Let's take a picture. gift out, and then we're going to start giving them. I think. We're going to see how many, how many favor we get this turn. It's not going to be much. I'm going to play like Oblivion again. Um, the Assault Rifle. Actually, that's not bad. Let's do it. Assault Rifle. Let's try and get as much damage as we can. Trigger's not, not bad here. Um, charge is an option. Yeah, let's... We'll just charge. Oh, he can't deal damage? Okay, never mind. We will just... Voice chain. Can't use his power. That doesn't make any sense to. Okay, overdrive is sweet. Um, what did we say? Mistbound? What happened to it? Did I lose it? Oh. Oh, right, because it's on the top of the deck. Whoops. Right. Good. decent hit points. Yeah, alright, let's enlighten. Yeah. Maybe not. Um let's just have her draw cards. Slash up. Second. That. Unfortunately, we're just not keeping pace here. Bad. Hooking up. Yeah, we'll just do looking up. Still just not keeping pace. Ooh. Alright. That's really not where we wanted to be here. But I think we gotta start gifting here. That's not pleasant. Oh dear. Did we just lose? Quite possible. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. All right, fickle fans. Um. Ooh. 
Yep, okay. Plasma Bat helps us out a lot here. Okay, sweet. So, I think we gift Mr. Fixer. But what else do we do? That's the question. Do we get rid of the bat? Just retcon the bat. And then... That way we can kind of open up for Mr. Fixer. Yeah. Um, what do we got? Just kind of blatant reference our way through this. Oh, wait. Yes. Okay. So, I can take a picture with Idessa, and that allows me to play another card. Um, I can blatant reference. Just trying to get a little bit more going here. And yeah, let's start gifting. Here you go, Mr. Fixer. Okay. Okay. Sure. Um. Sorry, Super Ultra. All right. Hair trigger. And then assault rifle. Slash. Uh, she's actually still really okay. Let's go ahead and do that. Come on, high Robin's Marcus. That'll work. And hit that thing. making quick work of these people. I can't give you guys enough gifts! I really wish he would shut up. Um... Let's 
let's see. And Karmic's fine. Oh, he's at three. Yeah, okay. Karmic Retribution needs to happen. <laughs> and we'll go ahead and look up again. Oh, right, he can't deal damage. Whoops. Hold on. No, no, no. Use power. No, you're fine. Yeah, I mean, you're pretty much just confirming what I'm going to do anyway, so... It's not hurting anything. Oh, man. Right. Can't... Uh. Alright. Hey, there we go. Hit her. You're big and ugly. I'm just going to hit you instead. Okay. So, stay alive, gift expat. Uh, yeah. No, we'll absolutely take a shot. Yep. Rude. Destroy one. Okay. Not using her signature gun, so she will throw it at Cargra's face. Um, that's annoying. That's really good. Unfortunately, that's just that's gotta go. Yep. Oh boy. Oh no. Oh good gosh. Oh boy. Oh no. Okay. And he's got nothing in hand, so. Here you go, expatriate. Alright, ammo. Yep. And the submachine gun. Okay. Retcon. That's fine. Um, RPGing the mutagen doesn't seem like nothing. It seems like it could be reasonable. Um, putting hollow points next to the submachine gun is also a consideration. Does that work? Yeah. So let's yeah let's go ahead and hollow points the submachine gun. Fire the submachine gun. Yep. That'll happen. Okay, we need to score three more here somehow. Yep. cripple her pretty pretty significantly and might buy us another turn. I think... Does Grease Gun just buy us another turn and hopefully we win that way? Disappointing. I like Mr. Fixer a lot, but I think I think the grease gun is just uh, just the power we need right now. Um, uh, and then we misbound next turn, hopefully. Come on, we have 
anything offensive? Probably not. So I guess I'm just gonna do this. Silver lining here. That oh, that actually wouldn't have been the worst idea. Oh, oh yeah, can't. Oh sweet, another silver lining. <laughs> All right, experimental mutagen again. You can't deal damage. Let's hope we can. Buy, us, buy ourselves another turn. Oh, sweet, but yeah. Okay, so go ham on Cargra. Got it. Yes. Gift setback? Is that right? I guess gift. Oh, I've already gifted her. Yeah, it does it gift. Just, just gift setback or gift guys? Gift. Nightmist has our. Oh, no, no, no. There we go. Yep. You're right. You're right. Um. I guess retcon to draw cards. That's disappointing. Disappointing use of retcon. Okay, sweet. Can't play it, but yep, it's uh, it's gift time for uh, for Night Mist. Okay, Oblivion. Nice. Uh, everything's gonna take one. turn and uh, gift guys and they'll get it, get everybody too for this particular game good gosh guys 34 <laughs> um, discard two cards and oh that's sweet um, that one's too good uh, another one of those seems fine. I uh, don't see myself playing that anytime soon. Um, and it's going to be Cargo Warfang. Alright. Fire for effect, folks. Nightmist sure is a crowd pleaser. Uh, so we get RPG launcher for some extra damage. Um, and then assault rifle with the incendiary rounds. Yep. All right. So let's RPG to get rid of that. And then, oh, Tardis. Right. Sure. Thank <laughs> you. 
Alright. Grease gun goes away. Um. Just. Alright. Hold tight. Top. Something that deals damage. Recovery. <laughs> yep, there's the key to the slash. Um, he's got nothing in his thing right now, so. So, yep. Oh, oh gosh! <laughs> okay. All right. So, guys, get does get to play all the does get to give all the gifts here. Problem is, we gotta find a way to put. Do that? Does that work? Sorry, Seamus. I, I trust you, but I don't know exactly how far back I have to go, so. He's about to gift himself. Hopefully this works. Unless someone else has gifts kicking around, but I don't think they do. Oh, Sapback does. Oh. Was that on... I can see why you want to do over. Yeah, hold on now. Storm doesn't picked up yet. All right. So you said do this one first, then Tarnus, then Cargra. Yeah. Yeah. 
All right, now we'll best card ever. We'll hit her. Card 11. Throw my hands in the air. Play extreme. And then gift myself. There we go. Now the strongest one. again. Um, that doesn't increase the damage at all. That doesn't either. Aha. Reload does. Let's get some hollow points back in action. We're in play, under the assault rifle. Let's take care of some business. Seven. Well. Yes, that's true. That's true. I didn't think of that. Mr. Fixer can now eat guys' cards. In charge will help with that. Push through two damage. Yes, I can. Yep. Oh dear. Or not. Right. There's no tokens in this pool. We can just lose here, folks. Is there a better way I can do that? Hold on. Because I knew it was there. I don't think I can. off the environment? One time. Nope. In fact, that's pretty much exactly the opposite of what we wanted to do. I think she just goes to 20 here. lost. Man. That was frustrating. Gosh. All right, well. You guys can have fun dealing with the rest of this. I'm out of here. Um, so guys runs away and finds himself hastily in Magmaria, of all places. 
Uh, and he encounters there um, the Prime Wardens, although Argent Adept not with them. Uh, let's get them kicking around. Argent Adept is not with them. Guys, however, is. Same thing, guys. Um, what's the Prime Warden? Uh, Tempest. Where is he? Tempest Cosmic. And uh, the villain in this case is Plague Rat. Here we go. Wow, that was that was a disappointingly close loss. <laughs> really uh, killed by our own titles there. Okay, guys, starting out with Guys the Barbarian, I can do that too. An Abrasive Retcon. Fanatic has Brutal Censure, Chastise, Final Dive, and Sacrosanct Martyr. Uh, Haka has Dominion, Abrasive Elbow Smash, and Enduring Intercession. Captain Cosmic has Augmented Ally, Conservation, Conservation of Energy, Dynamic Siphon, and Wounding Buffer. And Tempest has Chain Lightning, Gene Bound Shackles into the Stratosphere, and Lightning Slash. Oh, yeah, absolutely. It was a fun game. I just thought it would be challenging to try and give gifts during that battle. Alright, here we go. Oh, I guess we'll put that next to Haka. And another infection. Okay, well. That doesn't look like a present to me. Oh my gosh. <laughs> and here's another one. There we go. And everybody, it's an infection party. But I'm fine. I guess I showed up a little late. Uh, so I guess we can just start retconning infections. Oh yeah, that's right. He deals a bunch of damage if you do that. Let's just start us off on the back foot. No, let's let's back that up. I forgot about that bit. All right, I should probably know what their powers do. I haven't done Prime Wardens in a while. Oh yeah, I know what his does. Um, no. Come on. Wow. Okay. <laughs> um. All right, we're just gonna guys the barbarian. Start giving gifts. Seems fun. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, elbow smash. That one's interesting. Start going ham. Uh, we'll play a 
I, yeah, well, I will smash again. Sounds good. Let's do it. Dominion's probably the better play here, but... Chastise, then base to help guys. I guess I'll do that next turn. Oh, yeah. That's okay. Yeah, that's probably better. <laughs> back that far? No, I can't. Um, I mean, that would be nice if I could use the same thing twice. I can't. Um, ah. Dynamic Siphon does help guys. <laughs> Let's see how long we can keep that alive. We'll do that, too. Okay. Um, yeah, let's let's go ahead and gene-bound shackles, and then we can start doing crazy things next turn. Um, it's going to take a bunch of damage if you do this. That's fine. In this case, that's fine. We're just going to play one extra card. Yep. Environment deals some damage. We're going to deal him some damage. Um, I'll not do any more. Because three is quite a lot. So Brutal Censure. Alright, I'm gonna, hold on. I'm going to read this combo here. Stop doing things. Oh my goodness. Alright, what does Dynamic Second say? Whenever this card is, so we'll start there. Our guys can use a power. Everybody have cards. Yep. And then everybody else is going to take three. Oh, another infection. Okay. Well, guys is infected now. Everybody takes one. But guys can use his power again. Oh, no, no, no. Yeah. Uh, let's play a card. Wounding buffer? Sure. Um. Okay. Yeah. Oh dear. <laughs> that was just bad. I forgot about the infection. Uh, we'll draw a card. Yep, that was that was a mistake. Dang Twitch delay, you guys are so far behind me that I make mistakes and can I get back far enough to Eh, whatever. Alright, what did I put that? Ooh, that's the first time we've seen Look What I Found in this game. Yeah, for sure. Good. And we'll give some gifts. Gotta stay alive a little bit longer, though. I might be playing pretty loosely here. Alright. Yeah, that'll happen. She is hurting. Uh, brutal sensor. Censure. Okay. Well, <laughs> here we are. can use power. I think we start gifting next turn, unfortunately. Well, maybe not. Maybe we can stay alive another turn. We'll see. Oh, sweet. If we can get that into play somehow, 
That'll be better. Vitality Surge is definitely not nothing. Let's go ahead and Dominion, though. And Vitality Surge. Hey, sweet, another Dominion. Alright, so now we know better than to uh, Wounding Buffer. Oh dear. Um, we're definitely into that zone of the evening where I am not paying enough attention to... People only have one pet. Well, does now Fnatic has Sacrosync Martyr? That's bad. Um, unfortunately, I guess we're just gonna do this. It's not ideal. Alright. So we could Stratosphere here. Um,. Get rid of Plague Locust for a turn, but that's a turn. Alternately, we can Chain Lightning twice. There we go. Um, dealing him three damage now seems loose. We can just do it next turn. Okay. Sure. Yeah, he definitely flips over. Oh, this is looking on me. That's the start of the turn. Alright, it's an ongoing card. Turn the page, please. No. Okay. That's gonna be increased, so fanatics drop in here. Bummer. Man, that's five presents, or four presents I, was able, I wasn't able to give. You ungrateful. Yeah, I, I think I'm kind of in the same boat here. So we're going to start gifting. Um, so we're going to start with Tempest. See what happens. That lightning slash back. back seems great. Okay. Sweet. Thank you. Okay. Someone use a power. Yeah. Yeah, sure. Guys is going to give some more presents. gonna be able to give any more but there you are oh we are moving along uh, oh okay did not really oh wait wait a minute what does that say I didn't read that correctly. Your hero deals a hero target three toxic damage, and your oh no, that seems terrible. Um, I guess we'll just play Dominion. We're 
rampage. I mean... No. Uh, autonomous Blade. That's... First time... Okay. That's fine. It's not hurting anything. Oh, discard. Ah, uh, no, I don't need to do that. It's just really just a play to power up things like those. Um, really Tempest. It's not going to be around for much longer. Yep. Ugh. Oh dear. We have cleansing down for, so that's that's a thing. Yep, lightning slash, plague rat. Great. And then we will cleanse. Unless Yeah, it's great, but we really need to heal. <laughs> Just a little bit. Hopefully we can survive for one more turn. And get a couple more gifts given. This is some shenanigans. Any extra damage being dealt seems terrible. Oh dear, oh dear. Yep, Tempest is dropped. But I think we gave his gifts, so... Oh, now we're not giving any more gifts tonight. Or at least in this particular game. Must does his in cap give get, do anything with the gift? Oh, it does. Yeah. Okay, so we can we can still give gifts. There are still gifts that uh, that can be given. Um, I'll just play another one. I don't think we win this. I mean, 37 damage is an awful lot. Not dealing with the Plague Locust was probably a pretty good mistake. Yeah. Let's draw. Oh dear. And there goes Captain Cosmic, leaving just Haka. Well, okay. Um. Let's flip over this one. What does it do? Okay. So Storm goes to 25. Um, ha there, is a ch there is an outside chance that Haka could win this. However... Rampage is his only offensive thing right now. Haka of Restoration could bring him back a little bit. That's not helpful. You know what? Now we're never on the Rampage. Come on. Oh. Come on. There we go. Okay. That's finally gone. And he takes two. Okay. That's what it is. Um, I'm just going to gain health. It's not ideal, but... Oh dear. Dropping frames. I'm sorry, guys. Okay, we seem to be back now. All right. Um, I 
I'm gonna just give some health away here. Try and keep Haka alive. There is a chance we can win this with just Haka. Um. Okay. <laughs> this got goofy. Why is it that the environment is literally just doing exactly the same thing over and over again? It makes for a very unpredictable game, like... Okay. Yep. Okay, we're back around. Like... Okay. Let's flip this one. Storm goes to 26. Um, what's he got in hand right now? Punish the weak. Uh, so punish the weak, play Taeha on my turn. Punish the weak. Alright. Yep, that happens. Oh dear. Yep, Afflicted Frenzy sure is a thing. Punish the weak versus real good. Uh, but we gotta heal up real bad. Savage mana. I think that's not gonna help us here. A whole lot. Um, yep, draw a card or heal up as much as possible. Oh dear. We shall see. Um, come here. All right. Ooh. This is going to be interesting. Oh dear. Well, that'll do it. Wait, destroy Oh, shoot! There was one of these that could destroy ongoings. I wasn't even reading. Hold on. Madness. And he's down to one. Oh, and Afflicted Frenzy comes back, so we lose. Well, that was disappointing. Alright, well, in lieu of any more uh, loose play, I think I'll, I'll call it there for tonight. I did have one more game planned, but I'm not... Uh, not in a focused headspace anymore so I'm going to call it um, and we will do this okay uh, guys I hope you enjoyed tonight's Tales from the Archive on Handle Arbor Games it was quite fun uh, it, making guys do weird shenanigans the final storm ca final gifts delivered was 26 um, if you liked what you saw be sure to like comment and subscribe and share our channel both on social media and in person you can follow Handelabra on Twitter, Facebook, and YouTube, as well as Handelabra Games on Twitch. If you want to see more content from me, including the adjacent Hex podcast and the occasional sketch comedy video, 
Uh, Facebook.com forward slash another letdown is the place to be for that. If you have story submissions for me to tackle or just want to say hi, my, hit me up on Twitter. My name is at D E N O N C Z D. Um, the other place to submit stories is in the chat. It's tinyurl.com forward slash TFTA submit. Um, I'm going to be off for the next two weeks for uh, Giftmas and New New Guys. No, New Year's. I don't know how to make a pun. I, I'm, my pun engine is dead for right now. Uh, New Year's. Um, so, and I'm also going to spend some time checking the um, submission system and actually get some, uh, some fan-submitted games going after the start of the new year. Uh, Sentinels of the Multiverse is currently available for iOS, Android, and PC, Mac, and Linux via Steam. And as always, in good old-fashioned cardboard and ink. Um, one of these days I should probably... Well, anyway. Uh, as always, guys, thank you so much for tuning in. Thank you, Seamus Butler, for keeping track of the, uh, the gifts we gave tonight, uh, both with guys alive and incapacitated. Those are some pretty good games, uh, especially with guys being weird. And... Uh, have a wonderful holiday break, and I will talk to you guys after the new year.